Yeah. Everyone should be for Palestine. There's great atrocities happening there. Do you support the killing of millions of children in Palestine? Who, who support who? Do you support the killing that happening by Israel today? You said millions of children? Mass. You said millions? Millions. Okay, do you support killing the Jews in October 7? Never. No, I condemn that. Are you willing to spit? No, are you willing to spit at the one who told them to do that? I, I, yes, I spit on Hamas. No, the one who told them to do that is Muhammad. Now, why are you lying? Here we go. This is your prophet, and this is what he did to the Jews. They are following his step. They attack. This was in war time. They attack. This who, was who, war. who care about old or not? You are following for Islam now. Are you saying to me, this Muhammad was? War. Do you spit at Muhammad at that time? He was in a war against enemies. So what? They are, war. They are The Hamas is at war. A second ago, you spit at them. Yeah, but they're killing innocent people. Muhammad. Here we go. Your prophet, he killed. He captured mm -hmm. the Jews. He raped the women. And now the boys, he made them strip from their clothing. And anyone who have little hair around his private part, they slaughter him. I was Which... among the captors of Banu Qurayza. They, the companions, examined us, and those who had begun to grow hair, pubes, were killed, and those who had not were not were not killed. I was among those who had not grown hair. Uh -huh. Sahih by Al-Bani. So what, okay. he, was yeah. 11, yeah, yeah. he was 11 years old? He was 9 years old? What he was? Mm. 11 years old, he was he was you know, in, in the he Middle East. We, we are Middle Eastern, and we are hairy, oh. like monkeys. So in very young age, we start having a hair in our body. So now, okay. if you are 11 years old, most likely you are dead. But this wasn't his order. It was one of the Jews, one of the no, other no, people no, that they no, trusted. He, no, he is, telling you, he is telling you what the Muslims did. Yes, but why was that punishment? No, this is, the, this is not a crime they did. This is Bani Quraidah. They attacked Bani Quraidah. I was among the captive. This is the crime. The, he is a oh, child of Bani Quraiza. He is the child of oh. Bani Quraiza. The companion, they examine us. They capture them. Do you see captive? You see captive? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So he is mm -hmm. a captive of the Jews. The Jews are his family. He is a Jew. Why did not kill mm -hmm. him? Because he don't have hair around his pubic area. So now yeah. all those who have hair have been slaughtered. God knows how many thousand. Yeah, because they became mature. They are classified as no, men. No, they are not mature yet because I told you, those kids, they, it says the one who started, began, began to grow, even the hadith in front of you, began. They are kids. Yeah, they're kids, yeah. That's why they yeah. examine them, because they look kids. If they look but men... what was the reason? If they look men, but because they the are captive, the they are the children of the Jews. But why did Muhammad go against the Banu Quraiza? Because they did, not, they did not accept him. He wanted to take their money. Is this the part where he burned Kinana for the Jewish gold on his chest? Everything he did, it was to take for the money. The Jews are yeah, rich. Yeah, because he needed to. The Jews are he rich. The even, caravan, even he yeah. tortured people to, to, to find where they hide their money, just because they are Jews and rich. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, as you see here, it says, examined us. If they are obviously growing men, you don't need to examine them, right? Yeah, because he needed, he needed money to fund yeah, his campaign. But now, love, you, you so. just said a, a five minutes ago, do you agree with killing millions? It is you Muslims who kill millions. It is you Muslims who attack okay, everybody. Where is, where, I, I, I don't where is the Christians of Iraq? What happened? Iraq was 100% Christian. What happened to the Christian in Turkey? There's no Turkey. This is the land of, of the Greek. What happened to Armenia? Yeah. What happened to uh, Syria? What happened to Jordan? They, they what, this is all other Christians. You killed them all. I didn't kill no one. It's before your, my time. Your religion, the Muslims. So if you are against killing, you should stand against Islam. Join me. Yeah, okay. I'm against killing. I'm against killing, but Islam doesn't tell us to kill everyone. Islam it's not time no, war. Islam told you to kill everybody. And bring them like dogs with the chain around their necks, correct? Mm -hmm. I don't, I'm not sure. Huh? You no, are no. not sure? I, 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 I didn't know we could do that.
Allah. Yeah, the Muslim being told that they are the best of mankind, and because they yeah, are the best of mankind, you have mm -hmm. authority to kill all mankind and all bring them with the chain around their necks. You know, that doesn't make sense, huh? That doesn't make sense. If you're the best of mankind, why will you kill mankind? Because, Hypocrisy. because, because this is the, the white supremacist Arab. They are the best of mankind mm -hmm. and they can go and enslave everybody. And when you enslave them, either they will die as a slave for a Muslim, which is a blessing for them, supposedly, or yeah, the best they will convert to Islam. Uh -huh. and the those who bring them with chains around their necks till they embrace Islam and thereby save them from eternal punishment in the hellfire and make them enter Jannah. So he's saying to save people from... Yeah, because you should help people. Why, why wouldn't so I save I want to save you on? now. I decide to save you so you can accept Jesus. Shall I go to your home, put a chain around your neck like a dog, and drag you no. to my country? Yeah, because I want to save you, brother. Okay, yeah. The, the method is not good, but I understand the intention. Oh, uh, okay. Mm, I see. They're going about it in a very violent way. Uh-huh. But well, this is Riyadh Salihin, 1839, okay. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. I see, I see. Okay. Surah 3, 1, 1, 10. Uh-huh. Oh, this is Surah Imran, right? So maybe he's talking about those people, I don't know. Yeah, the Muslims are the best of mankind, and the Muslims, they say the Jews are racist. They say they are the chosen people of God. By the way, the Quran but, says... But the Jews are racist. The Quran says that Jews are chosen people of God, do you know? Bani Israel, yeah. Uh huh. So why the Muslim they lie and they say, when they say that they are lying and they are being supremacist, when the Muslim believe in that? But do you, but do you really believe that God only chose one people as His people, just the Jews out of all of humanity, out of the Indians, the Bangladesh, the no, Chinese, this is not what happened. Arab. This is not what happened. Come on. God, He chose those who chose Him from all those people. Only a guy, His name is Abraham. He chose to believe in God, and those has children. They follow their father. So. The whole people don't want to believe in him. There's only one group, one man, from all those people at that time. They believe in him. So they are chosen. Really? Have, they are chosen. So the whole world. They are man. Yeah, nobody. Okay, who, who was following uh, the God of Abraham at that time? Like, the majority would have, because this is early times, straight after Adam, no, a couple of hundred because, thousand years. Yeah, because you Muslims, you, you Muslims believe even Adam was a messenger of Allah, correct? Yeah. All right. So Adam and his children, they are messenger of Allah. So mankind, mm. they knew about Allah supposedly. So why they don't believe? Oh, because they were led astray by the mm. devils. Isn't it your Quran says that Allah, because nobody believed except one person, he made the flood? Uh, Noah, yeah. Okay. Right. So why you say to me, how come only one man believe? According to your Quran, which is a story copied from no, the Bible was... about Noah, well, only, one, one man. only one man believe in his family, supposedly. Maybe more people went into the boat with Noah. It's not just him, because yeah. if it was a flood and only he no, survived... No, according to your prophet, the according to your prophet, yeah. no, nobody was with him except his family. And even the donkey, uh, he was the last one to enter the, the ship. Mm -hmm. And he was so mm -hmm. slow, he could not get him in to the last moment. He asked him, why you don't get in? Why you are so slow? The donkey, he said to him, Shaitan is holding me from my tail, and this is why I cannot. So Shaitan, uh, uh, Noah, he spoke to the Shaitan. He says, let the donkey go, man. The Shaitan, he said, I will not let him get in unless you let me get him, nor him. And this is why Shaitan was okay. able to save from the flood of Noah, according to your prophet. Okay. You believe the story? Mm, makes sense. Makes sense to you that Shaitan hold the donkey tail, and Noah, he That's have to... That's why he's still here, right? Huh? That's why the devil's still here, right? I don't know if I am How there. I, if I am there, I will solve the Wait, problem I, so easy. I can solve the problem so easy. Shaitan is the holding. Bible, hold, on. The... hold on. Okay. Shaitan is holding the tail of the donkey. Mm. All what you need to do, just cut the tail. Okay. Yeah, you could think that, but then the cutting the tail will cause the donkey great pain for forty days. So what? So you can't do that. He's a prophet of Allah. Mm -hmm. He can make a miracle. 
Allah can fix it. Okay, so so now so, so you're a prophet. You're, alive, you're a prophet. Right? You're a prophet. When I justify why Shaitan is saved from the flood, mm. look like Shaitan do not know how to swim. So he come with this story that he hold the tail of the the, the donkey, and he told mm. Noah, "I will not let him get in unless, I mean, Noah for the sake of a donkey, he got a Shaitan. What an idiot!" So how, so how did the devil survive in the Bible? How do you survive the flood? Well, he is a devil. He is very powerful. The devil in the Bible, he's he's a foreign angel. What? Uh, uh -huh. what okay. What a, so you... what a what a flood will do to him? Uh, you know, Muslims okay. are very, you Muslims are really weird. Your your God, he claimed that Shaitan he can sleep in your nose, he can piss in your ears, he can be invisible, mm -hmm. he can go through walls, he can do so. He cannot hold the tree. He cannot swim. He cannot fly. You make him a fly. He fly too. So all those things can he do? Even even the, the mm. shaitan, he came to Muhammad in the in the image of, of Jibreel. So he can be an angel too. Okay. So someone he have hundred okay. of wings according to Islam. He can clone Jibreel. Can't he fly during the flood? Yeah, that makes sense as well. Yeah, maybe it's raining too much. I don't know. I wasn't he can. There. Uh, there's, there is many one a million right. way. He can make a big boobs for himself. He will float. <laughs> Yeah, this is why there, this, yeah. there are some uh, Muslim women, they go around the world to put silicone in their breast, big, bigger, huge. Why? Because they are waiting for the flood of Noah. When the flood comes, no. they will float. Christians do it too. Everyone does that. Well, I don't do know. That. I see this is weird. Uh, the Christian, uh, I don't know why anyone would do that. But uh, as long as we are talking about boobs, how big the boobs of the Muslim women in heaven? The swelling. Is what? Like swelling, their breasts are swelling. From what? Are you biting them? No, no, no. It just means it's uh, full. No, you just say the swelling. Yeah, swelling. In the Quran, it says their breasts are swelling. Why they are swelling? It's the word meaning like plump, you know, like juicy. Juicy? Juicy. They are juicy. Juicy baby. Really? Mm. Uh, juicy, tutti fruity. So, no, the Quran says, Kawaibun Atraba. You know what Kawaibun yeah, Atraba? Atraba? Look at Sandihaka, yes. yes. Ah, their breast is coming out like boom, 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 boom. Like when they walk in the street, when they walk in the street, they bounce. They bounce. Boing, boing, boing. What does what Sandihaka mean? A cup full to the brim, it's like swelling. I mean, do you see how stupid this religion is? No, because in heaven you, you you get what you want, and if people want sexy women, does it does it matter? Them. Does it matter if the cup is full to the brim or half? It matters to some people. <laughs> you are in heaven. You can drink as much as you want. Nobody is chasing you. It's for free. You have a river of wine. You have a river of everything. And now you will have a full cup. Really? What will happen it's if you have a half cup? It's always full. It never decreases. In heaven, it's unlimited, <laughs> infinite. So why it's full? Make it half, easy to drink. I will not spit on you myself. Can never finish it. If, <laughs> if I give you a cup from heaven, water, you will uh -huh. never be able to finish it. It's forever. It's, are you saying? You are you the saying problem. the cup you, I drink from it is going to be full before I without filling it? I don't know about that. Yeah, I because don't know about that. because what you said. No, this what it happened. According to the Quran, there is boys will go around you and they will serve you wine. It's not all going to be full always, right? There will be pearls. The boys will be like pearls. It just exactly, means they're be exactly, like... homo, you know. You, mm -hmm. Why you are so excited when you said pearls? You know, I don't know what you guys, did you hear what he said? Say it again. I said the boys will be like pearls, just yeah. meaning they're going to look large. Oof. Look very good, very nice. How nice, like pearls, white, very white, huh? You like white boys? Yes, those are very white. You like white boys? They're like servants. They're not boys for a sexy time. Why everything in heaven is white? The Muslims will be white. The boys will be white. The women will be white. You know white. Do you know white is the purest form of light? So are you saying to me if a black person is a black, he is not good? 
No, no, no. I don't mean by color. I mean by light. You know the color, red, orange, yellow, green. Uh, All the rainbow colors come from white light. If you shine a white light, it creates the rainbow, right? Oh, uh, okay. Anyway, my friend, it was nice talking to you. Uh, time for me to go because uh, I have a call from somebody want to buy my art. Hello? Good morning. First of all, I will never buy the art you made for the black tone. Okay, whoa, whoa, what's wrong with you? Why you will not buy it? If you don't buy it, people will buy it and put it in the market. People will not go to Hajj no more, become to kiss, to kiss the black stone. Because this is the original one, have a tongue. The one you have in the Kaaba does not have a tongue, does not have eyes, mm. does not have eyelashes. So people will come to my picture, not to yours. Get them breath. I will buy it in any price. Name your price. Okay, now we are talking. <laughs> I wanna Maybe, go. Can I just ask you one question? I just want to hold you, ask you two questions about Christianity, just two, because I've listened to you. I've tried to answer you to the best of my ability. I just want to ask you two questions. Go ahead. Okay. Number one, do you love Jesus Christ? Do I love Jesus? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know what kind of a question is that. Why do you think I would, I would say no? Look, so it's a yes, right? Sure, yes, absolutely. Okay. And then the second question following up from that, is if you could go back in time hypothetically and save him from the crucifixion would you do it why in the world i will save him from the crucifixion if he is jesus christ but so if you saw him dying and you're there you would do nothing to save him i do not need to save him because he is the messiah if he wanted that to happen he will never let them do it so he is the messiah he is god he do not need help of anyone i need his help so isn't it the messiah is the same person who did resurrect and come from the grave, which means a grave cannot hold him. Death cannot take him. Death means nothing to him. So why I want to save someone? Hold on. Why I want to save someone? He can resurrect people from death. He can give life even to mud, as the Quran says. He can give, he can create even part, body part, like what he did no, to the blind. Man. So why I want to hold on? Why I want to save someone like that? Who am I? He is the one who can save me. It's not this, the same case. That is the Messiah. The Messiah, he said, the Messiah said, nobody can take myself. I lay down myself. Nobody can take it. And then he says, mm -hmm. they can destroy this temple and I can rebuild it in three days. He was talking about his body. So the Messiah, he is the only one is capable to stand for countries and armies and the whole world. That is the Messiah, my friend. And that's why you Muslims and we Christians, are waiting for him, not to Muhammad. Muhammad is busy with Aisha and child molestation. Jesus, no, the judge, it doesn't say the, Quran, the judge will come back. The judge, the judge, he is the judge. Uh, in the Quran, it says, you said in the Quran doesn't say uh, he will come back. No, I don't think. No. All right. Yeah, you are right about that. But there is, uh, you know, you Muslims always use indication, right? Okay, yeah. Uh huh. So, uh, in the Quran, it says that none of the people of the book but is going to believe in him, is that correct? Before he die. Right. Okay. So Jesus, he will be back. Because simply, Why? yeah, because in order to believe in Jesus, you have to see Jesus. Those are, this is about the day of judgment. Right? What does it say? What does it say? In, in the Quran, it says, uh, uh, we can find in chapter 4, verse 159, none of the people of the book, which means, uh, uh, which, you know, which is weird to say, but anyway, none of them, but he have to believe in him before his believe death. Him. Yes, in him, the Messiah. We don't say Messiah. Ah, here we go. This is about the Messiah, my friend. Here. They killed him. Okay, yeah. They didn't know they uh -huh. crucified him. All right. Okay. So, oh. so the Messiah is coming back even in the Quran. And not only that, everybody in the world will believe in him before his death. So the Muslim believe that in his coming second time, the Messiah will die. But before his death, the whole world will believe in Jesus. And this is so in the I think it's sort of Maryam, he, So the he, one the one who said died. to you, the one who said to you 
that there's no proof that Jesus coming back coming back from the Quran is an ignorant. Mm. Yeah, and then we have the hadith, okay. tons of them, right? Mm. And okay. here actually, and here it talk about the Jews specifically, because all the Jews will believe in Jesus. In fact, this is in the total agreement with the with the Bible too, because the Jews the and the day, and the, the, end, the, end, the end of the time, the, 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 the people of Israel, the people of Israel, they will believe mm. in Jesus. Yes. Uh, it, it, when, so everyone will believe in Jesus in the end times. Do you think then there will be peace? The Muslims, the Jews, the no Christians, Muslims, the whole no world Muslims will, will go to hell. Muslims will go to hell. No, but we believe we believe in Jesus. No, you we don't. No, you Jesus don't. No, you, yeah. you have to believe in Jesus. Jesus, the true Jesus, not the one you have, Isa, mm -hmm. which which is a camel, you know. And same time, camel, doctor. yeah, camel, Isa. What what? How can what, you say what? that? Yeah. Uh, and then, in the same Jesus, and then, listen, listen, same time, the, the one you believe in is a coward. He ran away. He asked, didn't a, run away. A, a, yes, according to your Muslim stories, according to your prophet, yeah. he asked one of his disciples to take his look so he can run. That is a coward behavior. But is it, is it, isn't it in the Bible that God asked Jesus, Jesus asked God in the Garden of Gethsemane, take this cup from me? Is that coward? No. Jesus is he knew what would happen tomorrow so he's saying I, I yeah, you know, but he was, no 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 he you see the, the, uh, at the end he said let your will be uh, let your be uh, you know your will be done so Jesus he, no no you see because Jesus oh what he need to do he just can uh, as you said run away physically run away that's all he knew he knew they are coming he told even his disciple who will betray him or what he need to do an half hour before they come or an hour before they come he told them days before that you know they they uh, they will betray him like a day before. So, I will, tomorrow you will betray me, and this is what you will say. Yeah. Okay. So he have all the time to go. At that time, there's no ID, there's no passport. You are a man, like you so, know. You, you are go, you saying you? You, are you saying the desert. Was for you can go in the desert and you can escape. Nobody will find you. That's I, it. I think he knew he was going to die. Sorry. Are you saying that Jesus knew he was going to die? Sure, that's why he said, take this cup away from me. That's why he told the, the, the disciple, they, they will they deny me. That's why Jesus says, this is, uh, he took the bread and he says, this no, is my the, body. But, but, isn't, but the, but the isn't it Jesus, Jesus, isn't it Jesus, he said, this is my body, will be broken for you. And this is my blood, will be shed for you. Um, yeah, he did say that. Exactly, so he, he knew. Say. Yeah, he said that the day before, they... Uh, you know, uh, 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 decide so to if, I, if I know, if, if you know you're going to die tomorrow, like in a car crash, would you get inside that car tomorrow? My friend, I am not the Messiah. He is the Messiah. No grief can take him. No death can hold him. No Satan mm. can, can, can get close to him or, you know, tempt him. No one. This is yeah. the Messiah. This is the Messiah. So yeah. we are talking about yeah. the Bible says everything created by him and for him. So death is not... The problem death cannot stop Jesus. In fact, how can God die? This is this is what I can't think here. This is when I think about you. Christianity. Thank you very much. How can the, first of all, if mm. if a grave cannot take him, you know, mm. so how how he is dead? The Bible this, says this is what I don't the Bible know. says, hold on, mm. that we when the Messiah was in the cross, we worship him by the spirit. So he's always alive, even when he is in, you know, in the in the in the grave. So it doesn't matter what what uh, where he is. Like here we go. Mm -hmm. Before Jesus come to this earth, that means there is no Jesus, according to your understanding. Before, yeah, because no. he didn't have a physical body, right? I, yeah, but he came. He humbled himself. He took the image of a man. So now, we, it's, it's, so the body is there or not there? Still, the Messiah is there. Yeah, all right. Existing spirit. All right. Okay. So this, the, the, we worship him by the spirit, and God okay, is always so God is always alive. So you believe? Mm. Uh huh. Yeah. So with the Trinity, yeah, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. So you believe like Jesus is the body, but he's also when he died and resurrected, he became friend, the spirit again. If we believe that Jesus is God, if there is anything God cannot do. They could do everything. Okay, not your God. 
God is God. I no, can, God. can your can your God have a son? Uh, if he wanted to, if no, he had a, no, the Quran, he had a girlfriend. The Quran. There's two verses in the Quran speak about that. When it says if you want, he can. The other verse says, how he can he have a son if he don't have a girlfriend? Right. Yeah. All right. So your God, he gave. He he is the one who questioned his ability. So in order for Allah to have a son, he can. But he had to get a girlfriend first. Well, I can do that same too. Didn't, didn't your God need Mary to have Jesus? According mm. to your religion, the angels in in my belief is just to deliver the message to say to, to Mary, oh. you will have a child. But in your religion, uh -huh. in your religion, he blew the, in. the Holy Spirit is Jibreel. Yeah. All right. Well, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. It doesn't say the Holy Spirit is Jibreel. I, I, you are right. It doesn't say that. But according to your religion, the uh, uh, Allah He blew in Mary vagina, correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay. What what kind of God He do that? Why He do that? To blow into spirit of God into Mary's womb. Yeah, but uh, how how Allah He blew? He tells us through the messenger. Okay. Now I want to go. We have a how many how many how many they created Jesus Allah alone or Allah and the Holy Spirit. Allah sent his Holy Spirit to Mary. So Allah and the Holy both. Spirit, according to Islam, both are the one who created Jesus, correct? Correct. I want you to answer this question then. Correct. Responsible, I agree. Both in a part, uh, in, a, in a partial sense and a full sense. You said co uh, causal uh, overdetermination. I'm sorry to say you have not answered the question. The question is, can you have two subjects that are fully, fully responsible one, to a degree of 100% fully responsible for the creation of one thing in this entirety for example can you have two mothers that are fully responsible aha, fully responsible for the production of one child fully responsible and i think even the transgender movement would raise their <laughs> eyebrows you hear it even oh, the transgender even the transgender movement they will have eyebrows left up if you say so mm. but you just agreed that your God Allah and the Holy Spirit both they created Jesus, but this well, is yeah. If what can look, can two we, can two, mother, can two mothers can two mothers can two mothers give one baby? Thing no. in this entirety. For no. example, can you have two mothers that are fully responsible, <laughs> fully responsible for the production of one child, fully responsible? No. And I think even the transgender movement would raise their <laughs> eyebrows. See, actually, actually, hold on. There is a way they could have female babies. The doctors do IVF. There is a way. no, no, no. This is easy. Don't go there. So, two are creating one person. This is your religion, oh. Allah and Jibreel. Well, it takes two, it takes two, doesn't it? A man and a woman has to create a child. No, God no, no, and no, Mary. no, no, no. You see, no, 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 because Mary already is exist. Mary is exist, right? So, now yeah. we have a three. So now this, this, this stupid uh, Mimi Hijab, he's trying to be smart, supposedly. He do not know, maybe, because he's ignorant, like the rest of Muslims, that it is in his religion, not in my belief. In my belief, we don't believe that there's two mothers giving birth to Jesus. We don't believe in no, that. No, we don't believe we in be uh, So, no, so he's lying. That. He's lying about the Trinity. He's lying about what, we, about what we believe, playing games. But look what he did. By making such a fun, he made fun of the Quran, because it's yeah, in your religion. Yeah, he said some weird stuff. I, no? I don't trust Mimi Hijab. I don't like. I know. He but don't you agree with me Islam. that what he said is going to screw Islam? Yeah, I agree with you. But like, like I'm saying, like God and Mary, they produced Jesus right through the Holy Spirit. No, no, Mary. No, no you see, Jesus is not from Mary. Jesus is the Word of God who become a man. So Mary is just to deliver. How do you think it is flesh? Listen, listen, listen. The word of God, the word of God, become a man, not the egg of Mary. The, correct? Yes. All right. Yes. Yes. You're so right. The, the, the word, word of God. Went so into the word, Mary's the womb. word, become a man, yes. not a blood of Mary, not an egg of Mary, and not a semen of a man. But now, what Mimi Hijabi said, giving us a very oh. stupid answer, thinking that he is a smart. Can two mothers be producing yeah. one child? Yeah. In in it's the story good, in the uh, Quran, in the story of the Quran, there's a three. Hmm? In the Quran, yeah. the one who produced the child is a three. 
Yeah. Well, if I send you CP to a woman and I tell you to impregnate her, we are both responsible because I'm the one who sent you. You're the one who produced. No, 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 and no, then no, 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 yeah. you see? no, 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 so now Allah he said be that's what Allah did correct uh -huh. all right and Allah he sent the spirit which is the breed according to Muslims and he blow the spirit correct I'll go with you yeah all right that's so that's two action so Allah said be but Jesus was not there okay. yet which means the word be is silly and stupid because if you say be and he was you do not need to send the spirit to blow anything Right. Well, God says for the whole world be and it is, but no, still no, no, not, it, not in Islam. No, no, not in Islam. No, 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 not in Islam. God in the Bible, He, he said, let me let, no, 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 no. Show me, show me. God in Islam, He said, he God in Islam, He did not create things by be. This is the only time it's appear here. Be and He was, which is exactly. false, which is false, because the same Quran hmm. says Allah created Adam by His two hands. He made mud. Yeah. He mixed the mud. He fashioned yeah, the mud. Process. He fashioned the mud and then he dried him for 40 exactly. years and then after that he breathed into it. So be and was is That's a line. It's a process. But so so be be and was no, so the word be me does does what? If I make the mud, mix the dirt with water, and then I fashion the fashion stop. the mud, huh? B doesn't mean instant. In your mind, you're thinking B and it should be instant like magic. No, but God says B and it could take 100 years, 1,000 no, years. When no, no. When earth, you say B, no, no. This is, you see, you're trying to manipulate the word in front of you. It says B and it's going to be. That's it. There's no process. No process. The Bible, in the, in the Bible we have an example. In the, in the Bible, God said, let me light. Light was. That's it. All right. So here... What we have is a clear example that Muhammad is an idiot. He gave a false example because the Quran described the creation of Isa, not in the be and was, because as you see, Allah, he said be, Allah, he sent the spirit, the spirit to breathe, this is stage number three, and then Mary received the spirit, and then, according to the Muslim, by the way, interpretation, when the spirit breathed into Mary vagina, Allah made her horny, and then that, oh, look at this! No, 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 come on. I can show you. I don't even know if I want to see that again. Yeah, Allah make her horny, and that moved the semen what? which Allah created inside her previously. <laughs> uh, this is your religion. Oh my God! This is your religion. I've never heard of. Oh my God! You are talking to Christian Prince. Wow. Yeah. So when, when okay, uh, I need to I need to, I don't know. I, I, I want to check this out. All right.